Hello, hello, my kiddos. You know who it is. This is your friend, Dovi D, your former media podcast broadcaster and amateur in podcasting. And I have a special guest that you guys already know, but we're going to just, this show is about to start right now. Hello, hello, my kiddos. This is your friend, former media corporate Joey D. And the following is a sponsor ad. Anchor. Anchor is the app where you can create your podcast for free. And you can do amazing things with it. It has creation tools that allow you to record, edit your podcast right from your phone or computer. Anchor will Anchor will distribute your podcast for you so it can be heard on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, and many more. You can make money from your podcast with no minimum listenership. It's everything you needed to make a podcast in one place. Download the free Anchor app and go to Anchor FM to get started. I cannot wait to learn here your podcast. Bye-bye. Yobi? Yes. Hi, LaShawn. How are you? Very well. How are you? All right. How are you? How are you? Are you ready? All right. Quiet on the set. I'm ready. We're going in three, two, one. Hey there, Yovi D. It's Craig here from The Whistler. Just want to say hello. Yovi, I thank you so much for trusting me and for having so much passion. Jovi D, what is good, girl? I just want to thank you so much for the shout out, no doubt. I appreciate you because you're great. Hey, Yovi D. Uh, thank you so much for stopping by and uh, giving us some love. That was awesome. On which one? Shame or please don't date me? Please don't date me. <laughs> I'm curious. Oh my goodness. I chose... Positive vibes here. Congratulations with everything that you're doing. Just keep doing your thing. Keep being you. I love it. it it's mind-bottling in a sense because, yeah, that's just the power of technology. Hello, hello. Hi, kiddos. This is Joe D, your friend. A former media corporate in broadcasting and an entrepreneur venturing in podcasting. How are you? How are you? Welcome, welcome. The show is about to start right now. Hello, hello. The following is an ad. Have you ever thought about starting your own podcast? When I was trying to get this podcast off the ground, I had a lot of questions. How do I record an episode? How do I get my show into all the apps people like to listen? How, how do I make money from my podcast? The answer to every one of these questions is really simple. Anchor. Anchor is the one-stop shop for recording, hosting, distributing your podcast. Best of all, it's 100% free, kiddos, free and ridiculously easy to use. And now Anchor can match you with great sponsors who want to advertise on your podcast. That means you can get paid to podcast right away. In fact, that's what I'm doing right now by reading this ad. So what are you waiting for? So if you always wanted to start a podcast, make money doing it, go to anchor.fm backslash start to join me and the diverse community of podcasters already using Anchor. That's anchor.fm slash start. I can't wait to hear your podcast. Hello, hello, everyone. This is Tanika Drake from God's Gift Through His Word, and you are tuned in to the Yovi D Show. I am over here to just extend an invitation to all those that might want to participate and the SoCal Podcast Explosion 2020 creation. That means volunteers, vendors, speakers, and so much more. If you would like to help and you're interested, please let me know. Of course, you know, each and every time we're going to be doing this, I will let you know when it gets closer where the venue will be, the time, and the date. So keep listening because Yovi D will have exclusives when I come and drop it over. So I hope you guys are going to be blessed, motivated, inspired. Please also reach out to Yovi D if you're interested in participating. I will talk to you guys later. Have a blessed one. And I can't wait. SoCal Podcast Explosion 2020. 
All right, all right, my kiddos. This is the Joby D Show. We are back. We are back. And here is my amazing guest that you guys, she's very, she's a family of the show already. Say your name. My name is Angela, also known as Skid Row Sister. <laughs> you see, she is back, and she's back with really, really great news. It's, it's just so many projects that are coming up with her right now, and we're going to talk about it, so... Stick around. Uh, we have a word of our sponsors, and we're going to be back. Hello, hello, everyone. This is Tanika Drake from God's Gift Through His Word, and you are tuned in to the Yovi D Show. I am over here to just extend an invitation to all those that might want to participate and the SoCal Podcast Explosion 2020 creation. That means volunteers, vendors, speakers, and so much more. If you would like to help and you're interested, please let me know. Of course, you know, each and every time we're going to be doing this, I will let you know when it gets closer where the venue will be, the time, and the date. So keep listening because Jovi D will have exclusives when I come and drop it over. So I hope you guys are going to be blessed, motivated, inspired. Please also reach out to Yovi D if you're interested in participating. I will talk to you guys later. Have a blessed one and I can't wait. SoCal Podcast Explosion 2020. Hello, hello, my kiddos. We are back with our friend Angela. So we're going to really go straight to the point. Angela, yes. Angela, you can tell me about your experience working with Justin Bieber and Quavo. They were amazing human beings first. Um, they really enjoyed my art. Quavo gave the most heartfelt, sincere hug he just hailed me. We just kept hugging. And he was really, really amazing. That was uh, before they gave me the gift of studio time uh, so that I can forward my art or move forward. Your poetry. My poetry, my art, my spirit, everything that I am that I bring to the microphone. So... Obviously, you guys need to check out. There's a couple of clips on her Instagram account, which I already put the link on this podcast. Check it out. Tab on the video so you can see there's a piece specially recorded and featured Angela. You need to check it out. Uh, it's on YouTube. I'll put the link on this podcast so you can check it out. There's a long version. There's a short version. And Angela was part of the women that were featured. There were three women that were featured um, in this video about the cause of homeless. You know what? I'm going to stop talking because, Angela, <laughs> you're the ambassador of this information. So, speak up. Well, <clears throat> Justin Bieber has been off the scene for four years. So, he wanted to come back and he wanted... To do a tribute to women's stories because he is the product or the child of a single mother household he felt like he should say thank you and he should help women who are in the struggle uh, by coming by and featuring us and uh, giving us a voice giving us an audience so it was amazing he came through Alexandria House. It was a whirlwind. It was amazing. All of the children, all of the current residents, the past residents, the neighborhood, everybody was here and everybody was buzzing about this new music video. It's called Intentions. It has gone viral. That is amazing that my voice can be heard again and again. Um... 
with the words that the universe trusted through my mouth. I am so grateful for the way that things are going. A lot of doors have opened up for me. And I think that people now look at their day-to-day a different way. Because your intentions are what is behind all that other karma that people talk about. But you know what? Angela is being very humble and she's keeping it quiet <laughs> because this is a story. Angela, tell them how long or oh, your 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 artistic nurturing. How long has it taken for you to build up to this point? Tell them, tell them the truth. <laughs> tell them the truth. Because this is not a like they say, you know, it's an overnight success. Tell them the truth, Angela. This was, there were many nights. It's been an amazing. Leading up to this. It's been an amazing journey. I traveled here from Youngstown, Ohio in 2000. I left June 21st. I drove from Youngstown to Los Angeles. It took me seven days. I got here on the 28th. And that is where my wake up was that is when I became in touch with my art. I found myself on Skid Row in downtown Los Angeles. When I arrived there, I was not paralyzed by fear because that's what should happen when you arrive on Skid Row. I was inspired. I started getting words. Like I said, like I've said many times, this is where poetry met me on Skid Row. I got these words that turned into my signature piece, Skid Row Sister, which then turned into, it went into the book when I arrived in Alexandria House with my children. Miss Judy, who was the founding director, said, Angela, we're doing a book. We're doing a book. You want to put something in the book? I said, okay. So I put Skid Row Sister in the Alexandria House, A Home Between Homes book. That built an audience that led up to a one-woman show, which was on my birthday, February 16th, 2019. It was successful. It was amazing. There was an outpouring of love and support. And now I am working on doing an extended version of Project 216. Well, let, me, let me break it down for you guys. This is, <laughs> this is a very... Like you said, it's 20 years in the making, which, ha which has been flourishing right now. It, it obviously was a big kickoff for her having her theatrical debut, um, debut mm -hmm. last year. And that really, and now with this also contribution, amazingly, by Justin Bieber and Quavo and featuring her in their video intentions, it has solidified her purpose. You know, more than ever for the social, you know, causes that she really wants Absolutely. to, you know, she wants to really go ahead with. I am grateful. The platform, this is just now the beginning out of what has taken her 20 years to put together. Absolutely. And Angela has coming up a docu series. She wants a YouTube channel. She has a reality show in the works. She has a book coming up Absolutely. and another presentation again on another soon to be announced um, the theatrical presentation. Because guess what? A lot of people complain, but you know why they complain? They complain because they say that the show, the show was too short. <laughs> that was the complaint. That can you can you imagine? Complaint. It was so good <laughs> that they say, you know what? No, no, no. I wanted to sit there for at least two hours to just hear you sing and just <laughs> tell us all these wonderful, so amazing kind. words. That is so kind. And is... we had really a good set of musicians, but this one, as I said, we're going large and bigger. We have to. I need jazz musicians. Yes, sir. -y. I absolutely need a pianist, a bass guitarist, and I can just start with that. If I could just have somebody tickling the ivories for me, then that would do a lot and we'll grow it from there. You know, there's just 
there's just a lot of things going on. I and and I just want to just help her contribute in the sense.